Inside the EQS, captivating beauty awaits. Seductively sculpted, the new EQS from Mercedes EQ is equal parts elegant and sustainable. Our first fully electric luxury sedan has arrived. Why would they have weird the cars? Yeah, no cars? Well, I saw the tent. I didn't know. You saw a tent, but what do you think would have been under that? All right, just, just drive, just drive that way. Yeah. See, so you got. I want you to listen. I want you to listen, and I want you to think. In fact, that's the car right there. So I guess somebody already is here. And okay, we'll just keep going straight through. No, we're gonna go back here, right? I wanna go straight through. Not to condemn him. Oh, in fact, they got them right behind each other. That, that those two white ones. This white one and then that blue one. Big deal. Another shoe. Got, is that's not a test? No, those are not Teslas. That that's the car. Wait, wait, wait. Let this guy do what he's gonna do first and then we'll we'll go pat after. Okay. No, wait, let this guy just go, because we're not in a rush. They're taking the car, so by the time we get there, we got, still got to wait for them to get back. So just let this Bronco... So that's that's, that's, you see, this, this is a new Ford Bronco. Let him go. Those are both... You see them? Well, you can't see the blue one, but the white one that's is it. the new one, and then the blue one right behind it. So they, it seems like they have people going at the same time behind each other or something. So they'll, they'll probably instruct us what to do, but we're okay. Just let the Ford Bronco... Let him go. There's no rush. I mean, they take they take the cars. <laughs> it's like we're we're on time. We're pretty much on time. It's ten twenty four. We good. Oh, and that's a new Wagoneer. That uh, oh, well, you I can't see that. On, I that saw you see that yeah. that white one? Yeah, I saw that on. And who makes that? Jeep. Okay. The same people who make my car. Okay. Yeah, because I saw it on TV. I want to I wanna go no, right through there. Be, because yeah, 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 you see? Now, up, now you get up. hit. Right. I ain't going to get hit. I want to just... Uh, oh, well, I think you left. Who left? Okay, so go to the right right now. Because Michael Kors is on this side. There, you see that? You see the Mercedes-Benz thing? Up. Do not enter. All right. Yeah, that's why I want to go around. Be quiet. Watch this guy before you get hit. I'm going to stay right here. Truck. Which one? Right yeah, well, that? yeah, that's, uh, oh, that's the trailer. The trailer. Truck. Oh, so they got a couple more cars. Okay. Of course they yeah. do. They wouldn't have like two cars. Okay, let me find out where I can park. So good. They got a white interior with a 450. You know what? Yeah. I'm going to park right over there. That's the handicap. Ralph Lauren, there's a handicap yeah, right there. there right, go. there you go. That's what you do. Yeah. yeah, do what you do. Right here. Behind me. In this park. Yeah, oh, they got a Lucid store coming. That's, that? that's another company making electric cars. I uh, bought stock in their company. Scare you. Yeah. I told Jenny about that too, because Jenny, Jenny, she was like, oh, you should have told me about Tesla earlier. I was like, yeah, well, I'm not spending all my money in these casinos. Get some dividends. Yeah. So this Cadillac XT5 is going back. This uh, spring, this car is going back. So. Once this goes back, who knows? Unfortunately, the lyrics are sold out, so. Ooh, shiny. So we got the Lucid store. 
I'm gonna walk right up in there and be like, yeah, I'm a shareholder. Show me what you got. I wanna see what you got. What's the product? That's some white interior. Yeah. Next. Next. And then USA. Ooh, that little mask. And then we'll scan cool. your ID. Okay. Oh good, we're gonna go with the hyper screen, the excellent. Oh wait, this one doesn't have the hyper screen. It does not. Would you like to wait for it to return? Uh, I'll wait for it for me. We'll, we'll take the uh, 450 oh. for right now. You sure? Because it's the same ride. We can I know, just it's wait the same ride. She could see this one and then we'll look at the hyper screen when it's my turn. Okay. okay. Oh, okay, great. Okay, oh, so the white interior, great. Ugh, Jesus. Sweet. Yeah, so yeah, so the um, seat, you can adjust the seat right here on the door, and then all you have to start to do is open. Okay. So I can adjust the seat, okay, feel like I'm on the door right here. Yeah. You can push it back and forth. Whew. Would it be a problem you moving up a little? Um, I'm up as like. Oh, good. How are you? You're, you're okay? Good. You okay. Now? Okay. Okay. Now, I, I can only adjust. The mirror is by starting the car. Okay, good, it has a push start. Wow, that's a lot of stuff going on there. Mm -hmm. Does this one have the heated, cooled massage seat? This is not, these all are our base levels. A base level, okay. okay. So if you need a, your mirrors are right here. I noticed it didn't have the trim around the seat. Okay, now. The light. It, it is there. It is it? Yeah, it's there, this little. Okay, to it's adjust not the here. mirrors. Huh? Right here. Right here. The okay, hit the middle button again. That opens and closes them. Hit again. Now, the ones beside it, the left and the right, that's left and right mirror. Hit that. Now use the arrow. That's good. All right, now I'm going to do the, this one. No, that's the middle okay, button. Okay, hit it again. Okay, I'm going to get used to it. My car is a little different. Okay. All right, I'm good. All right, this one's good. Okay. Now, let me ask you, does this one have, I don't know if this do, one has. Does this adjust with the hand? Or? Manual, yes. Okay. Does this one have that uh, camera that watches your eyes so that when you look at the mirror, is it automatically knows which one you're looking at and it'll okay. adjust that mirror? That is not an option on this base model. Okay. You can get that option. You can yes, get that option. Yes. Okay. okay. But it's, yeah, these All are right. just our premium trims. Um, both our 450 and our 580s. Okay. So if everything is good, yes. you'll see here you're in park. You would just shift down into drive and then we can pull out. Okay, so it's here to yep. shift. Mm -hmm. so you're in drive. Oh, okay. So go ahead. We're going to go around like this Honda is doing. Okay. And go out that way. Oh. Very quiet. Mm hmm. We're going to go out to this stop sign and we're going to make a left. Okay. And you guys will have a Cadillac, is that what you yes. have? Both mm -hmm. of you or no. just? He has a Jeep. Yeah, I drive Jeep? Jeep SRT. Okay. Have you ever driven the electric before? No. Okay. I drove, well, Did I we? took you to drive Tesla. all the Teslas. Tesla. Tesla. Yeah, Tesla. we drove all the Teslas. I didn't particularly care for it. What did you like about it? I didn't like the style. I'm into, I'll be honest with you. Am I going to go left or right? Right left. Okay. I don't, like left I don't particularly care for the style. I love everything else about it, mm -hmm. you know, but style is something that I'm interested in. I'm retired. I enjoy, I want to enjoy myself. Mm -hmm. And this, you know, I'm a, I'm a designer, I'm a creative person, <coughs> and that style I don't particularly care for. Okay, too techy looking, huh? It, I'm, I'm trying to think of what I referred it to before. It's not so much techy. It's, uh, to me it's odd. Okay. Okay, that's fair. It's, it's a very odd shaped car. 
Okay. You know, it's beautiful in the sense of its, uh, you know, technology. Mm -hmm. You know, I was impressed with that. Mm -hmm. Should I stay here? No, you can go. Oh, because I don't want to block. Mm -hmm. It'll be okay. It's kind of like interesting here. So yeah. Now yeah, with our yeah. hyperscan, you also we'll do that one next. But that one has the three in one. But so looking here, mm -hmm. what's going to be very important for you to know is where the charging stations are. So okay. you can click here, this where to or this little icon. Mm -hmm. That will show you all the charging stations in the near vicinity. Mm -hmm. Like that. And then you, it'll show you by different level as well. Do you want me to stay in the right or the left lane? You can get in the right lane, that's fine. Yeah, you're good for now. Um, we do have a partnership with Electrify America that does offer complimentary DC fast charging for the first 24 months that you're in the vehicle. Mm -hmm. And usually the DC fast charging is shown here because they show your charging by levels. Mm -hmm. So you can do that. Um, there's also three different ways to charge the car. So like I mentioned, the DC fast charging. Um, but there is also, there is also um, level two. Mm -hmm. Level two is just kind of like hooking it into your, um, your laundry, your washer dryer hookup. Mm -hmm. That takes 11 and a quarter hours. And then if you're plugging so it in. it's like an overnight. Yeah. Yes, yes, it would be best. And we're going to make it right at this light. I don't make that known. Yeah. Anyway, but um, so, yeah. And also, we're going straight? Yeah, we're going to go straight. Okay. The cool thing about this vehicle, um, the range on this model is 350 miles per full charge, but that's very conservative. Okay. So, as you see right now, the bottom left of your display window mm -hmm. says 371. You can also check your range if you go here to this EQ menu. It shows your range here hmm. and all your consumption. Okay. So there is a feature called regenerative braking, and that also can give you a little bit of electricity back into the battery as you brake. Okay. Right now, you'll see we have it on normal recuperation. Mm -hmm. Now, you see these little paddles behind your um, steering wheel? Okay. You see, no, right here. The, these. Yeah, hit the left one once. Okay, continue driving. Let's go ahead. Just drive like normal. You're good. And you'll notice when you get ready to stop next time mm -hmm. that it stops a little bit different. Okay. Um, and you'll see, I just want to see how you feel about it. It'll be a little familiar to when you test drove the Tesla. Oh. You see how it did that? Oh, okay. Okay, so that's increasing the regeneration. So if you were to drive like that, you keep, she just keep driving, just mm -hmm. keep driving. Um, if you were to drive like that, of course, it will you know, eventually give you a little bit of extra charge. And that's the reason why also the range lasts longer in the city versus highway, because mm -hmm. you're braking a lot more. But you oh, wow. wouldn't want this brake option while you're driving on the highway, because no, as soon as you lifted no, your brake, it would, yeah, and people would probably get annoyed behind you. But you can turn it completely off. So we going? We keep going straight. Okay. So if you hit the right one twice, mm -hmm. you can do it as you're driving. You don't have to stop. Does, that, does that cancel? It cancels it. So hit the right one twice. So that turns it completely oh, off. Oh, I see, and it's moving. Mm -hmm. It's giving it more momentum. Exactly. Okay. So that'll probably stop a little bit more like what you're accustomed to. Okay. So I'll give you a chance to... Oh, I see it, I see it, I see it now. I, mm -hmm. see, I feel the difference. Right. Now, the third option, well, actually the fourth option, mm -hmm. would be it's called intelligent recuperation. Okay. So that's going to start to learn how you drive. So if you hit them, hold them both in at the same time. Perfect. So now it'll start to learn how you drive and you'll know when it started because there'll be like this little green icon right there that'll show every time you get ready to brake. Okay. So that'll start to happen in a while. Okay. okay. So with both of our vehicles too, you should know that we don't have a front space. So like Tesla is big on that additional space under the hood. We don't have that. So what's... Oh. So Mercedes made it so that it can't be opened. Um, Basically, the only thing that's underneath there is just wiring, uh, maybe some fluid, and in this actual vehicle, there's a HEPA filter, and what that's is literally. That? What does that mean? So that's going to filter the cabin to keep any like particles, ions, anything, any sulfur dioxide, and any kind of like pollutants and such <laughs> from entering the cabin. Okay, it's a lot like what they have on planes. So if you have allergies, you don't right. get allergies. Right, right. If you're driving through like the California wildfires, it's not going to reach you. <laughs> wow. Yeah. So 
if you needed to by chance say add like some windshield wiper fluid mm -hmm. you would um, add it into the uh, front there's a little compartment in the front driver fender area you can just pour it in and that's all so the only person that can get under there is a technician oh. and that they would probably look at under there when you go to like your um, your inspection oh, your yeah yeah your yeah, maintenance stopping. and there are, yep yeah because we have an intelligent right? Does this one have, the, the, you, you said this was a base model. This one doesn't have um, autonomous driving at all, does it? None of them do. So we are only level two autonomy. Okay. So it does not self-drive. Neither does the 580, but it does self-park. And there are some autonomy features, but mm -hmm. it, it won't self-drive. Okay. So like if you take your eyes off the road or your hands off for like about 15 seconds, it'll start to slow you down and stop you. And if you don't put them on, it'll call police. Oh, it's, if you don't put them yeah, on, it'll... Yeah, because it'll think that you had, like, a heart attack or something. Right. Oh, wow. You know, it's a safety feature. The Cadillac did that when I test drove the Cadillac. That was a safety feature right. a couple of years ago. Right. And, and the car actually started to slow down. Actually, it moved to the side, which I thought was sh shocking. Yeah, that's what ours does. It bumps you over to the side, it and it slows down. Incredible. And if you don't start to, like, respond, it'll call the police. Yes. Oh, thing. wow. Yeah, we have our SOS feature here. So, um, and then as far as like other things, I mean, we've got a wireless charging pod here. Of course, okay. you can see our panoramic roof. So you can yeah, yeah, yeah. Right that like. We're gonna move right up here. Right. Mm -hmm. Both vehicles have the ambient lighting. I know you were talking about that before. We'll find that under this comfort menu. Mm -hmm. There's 128 color options. So, what? yeah, you it's see hard the, to see, you right? see the light you see lines kind of going around. They're all underneath the seat. They're supposed to be inside the trim here. Uh -huh. It's hard to see sometimes during the day. Okay. But we can change those. You can make your own colors if you want to here, or you can pick out here. Yeah. It's beautiful to drive it at night. It's so beautiful oh, on the inside. But yeah, so there's that. Um, we do have the artificial intelligence. You can turn her off. If she, if you say that, hey, Mercedes, I don't want to call her, she gets really annoying sometimes. Uh -huh. but she's, you can turn her off if you don't like to have it. Um, what does she do? Anything. If hey, Mercedes, have, I'm cold. Oh, so watch. Hey, Mercedes, I'm cold. See if turned her off. Hold on. Sometimes people turn her off. You can also say, hey, Mercedes, my back hurts, and it'll turn the massage seats off. on. If you have it, or hey, Mercedes, we're the McDonald's. She'll route you there. Oh, or hey, Mercedes, cool. turn off lane keep assist. Or hey, Mercedes, <laughs> yeah. See? When sitting, make sure to straighten your spine and relax your shoulders. Okay. Because oh, she heard you say my, my back, back hurts. hurts yeah. <laughs> okay, now you're a physician. Sounds Right. Now, let me ask this question. I definitely want one with white interior. How hard is this to clean? I have no idea. Oh, okay. All right, no, fair enough, clean? fair enough. I don't know how hard is this is clean. Because I, I assume this is Mercedes-Benz Tex. Yes. This is, yeah, because my only, you see that? And that was the one thing I've always wanted because um, I just wondered how hard is it to clean these things? Because I've always got black interiors and I definitely want my next car to be a white, white interior. car. Mm -hmm. You know. Unfortunately, I'm not certain of how easy or hard it is to clean. Mm -hmm. I don't know if any of us know that. I think maybe the dealer would probably be a better person because they're there cleaning it. Right. Right. You can always call and speak to their technicians or speak to their it's service the department. Yeah, we're going to make it right here. We're going to make it right up here. I would call and ask the service department because mm -hmm. they probably have special um, shampoos and stuff that they use actually. Or they might even have a program where they do it for you for the first year. Whatever dealership you have, now they have those incentives. Yeah, because I, I like that. I love the interior color. But my thing is, is like, is it, you know. Yeah, have them throw it in a, for, in a package for you. I, buy the I, I see all these people with the, the getting the Teslas and everybody's getting that white interior with either red or white. Got it. You know, and I, I want a white interior. Got it. Every car I've had up till now has been black. I understand. And I, I tried to dissuade my mother when she got this last Cadillac, mm -hmm. and she's gonna she's gonna get another one or something else. Well, and I tried to dissuade her from getting this color simply because I didn't know about the you know cleaning. Yeah. Well, I mean, one of the things that you know when you call a dealership and you're working on a deal, yeah. have them throw that package in there mm -hmm. because they have a service department probably that will wash your car and detail and all that. Have them throw that package in there. 
free detail for a year or something like that. You know what I mean? Yeah. They did that when I got the SRX. Yeah. It was free, uh, mm -hmm. free cleaning for a year. So oh, no, I see the light yet? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it was free cleaning for a year. Okay, and the, because I had the beige interior on that first XR. Right. Yeah, I had the beige interior. That was a deluxe premium model. Uh -huh. You know, so I like that. It was very pretty. Okay, I think I can go. Yep, you can go. Now, the uh, loaded one that you have with the hyper screen, I guess that's only the 580, right? That's the 580. Yeah. All the four, this is the rear wheel drive one. This is the rear wheel drive. Okay. Yeah, so you're going to be interested in the 580. Anyway. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, you're going to want a formatic. That one's got the dual motors. My, uh, my dealer, he I called, they, here. yeah, yeah, I'll let you guide her. Yep. Yeah, my dealer called me in because they had just gotten a 450 just like this in. So I saw this one already. I just haven't seen the hyperscreen model. Okay. So your dealer actually had it to show people? No, no, no. He got it. He got the 450 yesterday. Okay. And was it somebody else's order? I think it was a demo. I think it was only what? a demo. I don't yeah. know how. Because, okay, this is interesting because we're told they don't have any to show the demo. They're not ready to be delivered yet. I'm like, um, how do you get it? Huntington has one and Massapequa has one right now. I know because I was there last night. Okay. Um, but Huntington sent theirs out to get detailed. Um, but they had both of them had 450s. They didn't have the 580 and they yeah. didn't have a hyperscreen. Nope. So you can't put a hyperscreen in a 450 anymore. That's unfortunate. It's the chip shortage. Oh. Yeah, I messed that up. You mean and then it all. Me that's still a shortage. That's still oh, a yeah. It's a big deal. It's a shortage on everything. It's a big deal. And then the port issue. Should I turn? You can. Okay. Yeah, after, you yeah, after the uh, Volkswagen. Yeah. Because there's nothing else coming, so I figured. Yeah, and then they also, so the pickle trap package was supposed to allow. Nice drive. Yeah, the pickle yes. package was supposed to allow monitors and the headrests, and okay. now we can't do that anymore. So you, so the 450 can't get the monitors. Either can the 580 because of the chip shortage. What? It messed everything up. Oh my god. Yeah, we're gonna turn right in here. And we're gonna go right back. Where That's we like half the car. It, I mean, it is, and it is. I mean, and I don't even know what to tell anybody about it. It's just something that we couldn't do anything about. Yeah, that's like half the car gone right there. Yeah, it's very unfortunate. All right, we can make it right. Yeah, I will say, kind. Well, yeah, not having up, not having the hyperscreen option in the 450. I think most people are going to go for a 580 anyway, just because the all-wheel drive. Oh, absolutely. I wouldn't live anywhere near here without that. Yeah. Oh, wait, does he want me to go? I don't want to oh, kill him. There you go. Push this yeah, button right here. Push it to turn this, it off. Yeah, you could do that too. Wait a minute. Either way, you can push here to park or you just turn it off. Yeah, it'll do the same thing. It'll do thing. the same thing. No, no. Push the push button. The button. Oh, push the button. Yeah, and, and then hit, hit park stop. And hit stop. Yeah, or you can choose to just hit stop okay, and it'll do the same thing. Okay. All right. Nice drive. Nice drive. Okay. The windshield wiper fluid. Oh, right here. Oh, that's cool. You gotta pour it in there. Yeah. Okay, let's see the so, toilet. Okay. Let's see how much space you got. Sure, what I'll do, I'll show you guys the static truck, and then what we'll do is hop in line before somebody else gets in line for that. Okay. Yeah. I don't really know. Get out of here. I like that. And then also, there's a boot kit, too. So they've been disabled on these, but if you like, kick your foot under there, that'll also. Oh, it's a boot. Okay. Yeah. I like that. Okay, okay. what's that? This is a little storage space. Okay. All right, the lines or the headlights? Okay, so you're going to drive that one, I'm not driving it. Uh, yes? That's what I, I want you to drive the front there. Because this way you get to see it with the uh, screen in it, and you also see how the feel of the differences with the all wheel drive. Yeah, you notice the wheels are bigger. Yeah, I 
The new rims that they have on the plate modes are really nice rims. Those are really nice rims. I think they fit your spoke pattern. They might, yeah, yes. So maybe, you know, you can always find them on eBay. But I like the original Tesla ones that had the aerodynamic rims. I always thought those mm. You mean with the wheel covers? The wheel covers, yeah. yeah. Most people try to take them off. Yeah. All right. So this is the hyper screen. Yes. So this is the hyper screen. John, hold on to my bag. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. This is... Yeah. Notice the, the positioning of the buttons is different. So this one has a passenger screen where the passenger can watch television on their own on the third screen. Wow. Thank you. Awesome. Yeah. The passenger screen. You can... So they have Amazon Fire television, too? Oh, yeah. There you go. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, so... The power button. You see that little power? You and see? You have, wait, hold on. You see that thing right there that looks like a black flat thing? The the car scans your fingerprint to know who file. you are. Yeah. So it can adjust and, it how you yeah. like so it. So now I can adjust the mirrors only when yep. it's on. Okay. Yep. Same thing. So okay, go ahead so and adjust I your seat. Remember where your... it is. <laughs> okay. Let me just. I needed it because it was hot. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Okay, let's see. It just now, this one also has the again. massage heated cool seats, right? It, this model In the front, she does. Says. Yeah, she said, hit her massage front. driver passenger. Why there you I go. I keep doing that. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, I feel it. I feel it. Yeah. Okay, now I need to just adjust this one. Okay, I keep doing that because it's so tiny. <laughs> Big fingers. Okay, let me just do this. Okay. Looking certain. Oh, I was just trying to turn the radio down. Oh, we can just pause yeah, turn it. Okay. Turn we the radio off. Can pause it right here. Now, where's Mute. the charging? Is that this? There we go. It has a wireless charger is right here. Right there. Or you have the um, C type, Type okay. C. All right. There's now, uh, six of them in here. Now it's the same thing. Pull here. it down. Yeah. Okay. And let's go out that way. Can we open the shade? Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. That's a nice shade. That's a really nice shade. Yeah, so this is the one. So this is the one that you would like. This is what, I like this one better because I don't Hyper like screen. I'll be with you, I don't like that extra screen. Mm -hmm. This to me is mm -hmm. more natural. Mm -hmm. sure. Got it. And you can even change the display screen in front of you right on the steering wheel where you are. Really? On the left part of the steering wheel, there's a little home button. And if you click on that, um, you can toggle through which display screen so you can put the navigation screen in front of yourself if you don't want it here uh -huh. now if you were I to like go this. yeah but and even i get one on my side too i can um i like I it. and i love the fact that, look at this and that traffic view camera it's very crisp. i love the fact that it's huge so That's like beautiful. you can um if you want to try you can go ahead if i don't see any there's not a lot of traffic right yeah. now i would just okay yeah, this is a nice one. This is beautiful. All right. So if you hit that uh, home button that's right here. Okay. Okay, hit that. And you see there's different options. So you see those little arrows right next to it. You can slide across them to go back and forth to which display you like. So say, just scratch. Like, no. So if you hit here, and then you take this and you just kind of swipe back and forth. Oh. And then you can hit OK and choose a different display oh, screen I if you I want. I think I'm going to go back to the other one. You can. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Whichever like one you want. <laughs> No, no. Nope, nope. These, these and little arrows. Back and okay. forth. No, don't click it. Just slide across it. it. Slide. 
Oh, there with we your go. finger. And now click it. Slip, sli yeah, whichever one. Yep. Now hit OK. There you go. Uh, I'll stick with this one. That's OK. This is <laughs> whichever one you want to do. <laughs> but it's beautiful. So I like have. So I have the ventilated seats going. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm doing the, here. On the side. So it's cool, and you can turn the heat on on the seats. But it's do not for me. Well, I've had to turn the heat on my seat on time <clears> my <throat> back was hurting. You can do that. And that that option is here. Okay. Or you can also tell Mercedes to do it. Oh, that's just saying it kind of close to that. But we're going to take the same route that we just took. How can I? Oh, sorry. I'm going to say Mercedes. She heard me. So, <laughs> sometimes she can get a little annoyed. Cancel. I'm sorry. Cancel. You can turn her off if you want. Oh, I want to try this one. Hey, Mercedes, tell me a joke. Sorry, my engineers were German. <laughs> yeah. What? You ask it to tell you a joke, but it can't because German people don't believe in jokes, apparently. That's what she said. Hey, Mercedes. Hey, Mercedes. How may I help you? I'm stressed out. Okay, I'll turn on a relaxing massage for you. Have fun. Yeah, or she'll say, think about something pleasant, like the day that we first met. She said that. She somebody is passing the, like somebody's, at, um, at the right, at the light. It's warning about the uh, seatbelt oh, for somebody. Oh, she not have your seatbelt on. Oh, yeah. my God. <laughs> yeah, it's not that big a deal. Just you know, pull over I and, you know. do, I always put my seatbelt on. Yeah, I got too excited. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I don't pull. And it's been trying to tell me that. For yeah, just pull right over behind this guy. No yeah, I'm surprised it didn't just say, "Excuse me, your seatbelt's off." That would that would have made it kind of, uh, you know. Oh my goodness! It's a little scary, and I didn't even notice it. Okay, mm -hmm. now now you can just you're in drive, so just hit the gas and go. Yeah. <coughs> hit the gas. <laughs> yeah. So, and the same thing applies. You still get that brake control however you want to do it that's still the same so that's the reason why we're kind of mm -hmm. just relaxing because i pretty much explained everything to you mm -hmm. everything's the same um now the cool thing your passenger they can do all driver i mean they can do most functions except for any driving function so i can't turn on your dynamic select let's see what you're on anyway right now you're scoring quickly eco um apparently you can play games on here like there's Tetris or Sudoku. Um, it was originally that you weren't supposed to be able to play while the vehicle's in motion, but I don't know how they. Like, if she doesn't, th this camera's on this thing. Right. If so she, she looks, looks over, over there, it's it'll turn, turn it off. off. Right. Mm -hmm. But it was originally that you well, you weren't the, supposed to. This was it's on the supposed, passenger side. So. Right. Right. But if you look over or if you lean over, like if you're, it's if you're. Um, if it thinks you're paying attention. If it over thinks there. you're leaning over for some reason, it'll turn it off. Mm -hmm. And supposedly, if you look at the mirror, you want to adjust. Warm in here, so what okay, do do? Mercedes, I'm hot. Hey, Mercedes, I'm hot. I'm setting the temperature to minimum. There you go. Thank you. Now, supposedly, if you adjust your mirrors simply by looking at the side that you want to adjust, it will know which side you want to adjust. Right, but it's not going to do that in this space. It no. won't do that. No, okay. not in the premium. But originally, you weren't supposed to. It was always grayed out. And I don't know why, as of this week, all of a sudden, now I can sit here and play mm -hmm. while you're driving. All right, just going to turn the... Uh, oh, would you just mute the music? Thanks. Thank you. I want to just make sure the computer hears this all. Mm -hmm. And we can change. Let me see what sounds. So... Yeah, you just touch the uh, off. Yeah. There you go. Excellent. I love this colors. Ambiance. Mm -hmm. oh, Can you change it to orange? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we can create our own orange. Let's see. Is that orange or not? Yes. Okay. Yeah, I like that. Orange. We did. Very. Mm. It's very pretty. It's gorgeous. 
It's very pretty. Very expensive home. Oh, I know. Oh my God. You know what though? Yeah, we're talking about in the tens of millions of dollars. But the crazy part to me is like a house like that. Yeah. The house like that in Cleveland? Yeah. <laughs> $300,000? Yeah. yeah. Well. Welcome yeah. to New York, right? New York, New York. Oh, know. look at that house. Jesus Ooh, Christ. That's huge. Jeez. I never seen that one. Yeah, I don't know. These are pretty. Uh, yeah, that's nice. Millions of dollars. Definitely yeah. for the location. You know, and strangely enough, my sister owns a brownstone in Brooklyn. Not a huge brownstone. It's just been appraised at $4.5 million. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, location, location, location. Absolutely. Okay? So, this is what New York is all about. I thank God that I bought my house when I bought it because now my house has now been appraised for hundreds of thousands more mm -hmm. because people are leaving New York and those who are coming in are coming in with a lot of money. Okay. I've been offered quite a bit of money for my house, but I'm not selling it. I'm leaving looking for more property, but that's that's hard. Right. Yeah. They have these are their estates in this these this area. Okay. Um, estates over here. This is a really cute area. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And some of these houses probably have been owned by families for years. Oh yeah, absolutely. You know, and when they bought them, maybe they maybe they paid a hundred thousand for them. And now they're worth millions. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, it's so crazy. Yeah, well. Location, location, location. Absolutely. Yes, I can see it. Feel it blowing through my seat. Do you feel it blowing through your seat? What? The cool air, the ventilation? Well, I have I mine feel on. feel it's moderate. There's so a heated and on. cool button on right the right side. On the side by your door. Look you where your it? hand is. Okay, look at my door. Left hand. This is cooling. Mm -hmm. This is heating. So, and then you also have the option of controlling the right, the passenger seat too. Yeah, so the okay. one that's, yeah, that's how you can turn your seat on heating and cooling. Hmm. It feels good. I, I feel the massage too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you can change the types of massage. You can make it so that it uh, massages your bottom too. Uh, let's see. Wow. You can, yeah, deep workout. I didn't try that one. There's also a thigh cushion. Yep. For your, uh, right. like, that's, that's, there's a, there's like for waterfall, like right you under you your knees. Right. They're hawking so you can make a right. Oh, you can actually yeah, turn no. right But you know your... what? I don't make a right until that arrow comes on. So they can This wait. one doesn't have an arrow, I don't believe. Yeah, but after stop, stop you're right allowed line. to make a right after yeah, stop. Otherwise, you are three seconds. Yeah. Out here in Long Island, people get very upset with you. Yeah, you well, do. you know what? And guess what? <laughs> I'm from Queens, New York. <laughs> and in New York, unless there's a sign that says, after you make that stop, you can make you can go forward and through the red light because we do have some of those signs. Mm -hmm. I'm not doing. It. Nobody's giving me a ticket. That's weird. These tickets are no joke. Are they? But no. Oh yeah, it's all punitive here. Oh, this is weird. This one, this deep wave. I'm not, I don't like that one. Do you like that one? That feels weird. Deep that was, wave. That was interesting. Yeah. I don't know. Ooh, what that was that? interesting. I'm oh, trying to figure no. out what was that for. Oh no. I What's put the it point on, of that? I put it on deep waves, but I feel like that's. <laughs> That's a little weird. I don't well, for know. your thighs, yeah. That's interesting. I'm not sure about that one. Let's see. Mm -hmm. No, I'm a safe driver. I can't take it. I can't. Uh, you blow at me. Go around me. Mm -hmm. I, I, my adage is, if you're in that much of a hurry, you should have started out a little bit earlier, and you would have been in front of me. Right. You know, I'm not. No, I'm, I've, I've gotten a lot of those homes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm a safe driver. Uh, I don't mind. I like doing the slower test drives. I that one that I had scared the mess out of me, so I'm I'm okay. Which I'm just, one had scared you? Oh my god! I did a test drive on Thursday. These two younger guys. The first one was okay. Then we switched, and the second one maniac. I should have made him get out. I should have made him get out uh -oh. because there was warning because he asked me. He's like, anybody crash these? And I'm like, well, <laughs> and then he I'm immediately not. goes to almost rearing the person in front no. of us. And I should have been like, you know what? Let's switch. It's time for him to leave. But then he takes out on this one right here. It's rush hour Thursday. He's like, "What's the speed on this?" I'm like, "Well, the top oh speed is 130." He tried to take it to top speed. Trying to take it to top speed. Oh. It's rush hour. See, you know what Tesla does on on one of these roads? I think it's Searingtown Road. If you test drive a Tesla Ludicrous, 
they will actually on one of those roads they'll actually let you uh accelerate this thing oh, like I'm, and I, I i've done it to like a hundred or something but they allowed it it was okay right the only thing about it is you know state law doesn't really you know permit we all allow that. it too but i thought it was really reckless yeah to do it in rush hour and there's pedestrians walking on the side of this road right here, and he was just swerving, swerving, swerving. I mean, it, it was wild. It was way too much. Well, always are on the side of safety. Right. And then after he did that, now the cops watched. Oh, of course. Of course, so yeah. He kind of ruined it for everybody. Of course. Mm -hmm. I don't need to go fast. Right. Yeah, and that's the whole thing. You don't need to speed in these no. electric cars. You really don't. No, you you don't. just need highway speed, and that's about it. But um, other than that, you try to save your battery, so right. you make or it through the week. Right. Or even if you're just test driving, if you just punch it a little bit just to see what the instant torque is like, that's enough. You don't got to take it there, all the way there, not on a, a crowded road. Yeah. Okay. That's my favorite part. <laughs> yeah, well, those seats, those seats should be, like, basic in every single one of these things, honestly. Man. And the S-Class. At some point, it probably will be. It may. But if you want them in your rear seat, you gotta get the pinnacle trim. Yeah, I don't, I don't uh, need to entertain. You that? gotta take it to the top level trim level, okay. and then you also maybe went um, interested in the winter package, depending on how much you drive. But here, this is all wheel. This is all wheel, but the winter package will get you the heated steering wheel, mm. um, windshield wiper, windshield wiper, uh, windshield. So this one does where, not have a heated steering the wheel. Windshield wipers. Mm -hmm. They're oh. there, so if you on the other side, this. On the other side over there, yeah. flip this thing like this. It's probably no, automatic, so a, you'll have to turn no, no, it. You'll have to turn it. You, you turn it. Yeah, they're automatic. Oh, yeah. Oh, they're hidden. <laughs> right. Yeah. If, if if water fell on the shield, then it would know right. to turn them on. Exactly. But they, a lot of this stuff's automatic. Right. Okay. Then if you ever get pushed, I'm like, I don't know, I got just ask Mercedes to do it. Seriously, <laughs> tell her to do it. She'll do it. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's so cool. Go ahead. Okay, got the right one here. This guy, you wait right there. Yeah, I'm gonna we'll make this right right here. Never know. Some people are in a hurry. True. You know. True. We get a lot of that in New York. Oh yes. <laughs> when I uh, okay, landed, am I gonna go yeah, around, we're gonna go right? to the stop sign and we're gonna go around. Okay. When I landed, my lift driver when he pulled up, he got into a fist fight with another lift driver. Yeah. It was, yeah. <laughs> And I'm like, okay. Very competitive. Yeah, they're crazy. Very competitive. Okay. Yeah, but didn't you pre-arrange a specific car? Yes, but I think they had a road rage situation while they were both pulling oh, into okay. the air. Yeah, that'll do it. And they got out and they duked it out so fast. It was so weird. And then he didn't say anything to me. Should we'll stop right oh. here? You can go up and move up a little bit oh. more. A little bit more. And you're good. Right here. I would oh, stop. Okay. I'm going to turn it off. You can just hit stop. Okay. Man, this is so cool. I love it. I love so, it. Every day you're living a mile warranty. And if it breaks right before the warranty, I get another 175,000 miles out of it. That's fine. Yeah. Yeah, but I definitely want to get an electric car next. I want it to really have a lot of self-driving stuff. And, uh, you know, at my house, I can charge the thing. So I really don't care so much about the range because all of these things are basically 300 miles or better. Yeah, just so, so. you know, when you're running it at the winter time, mm -hmm. it, you reduce the range, yeah. You're going to go down by about 3%. Yeah, I got that. I'm sure these cars are the same. I could be wrong. I mean, I would have to try one out. Yeah. Um, what it is is you're running the air, the heater. It's the heater. You're running the yeah, heater. Yeah, the air conditioning barely touches the car. But the scary thing is, is if you're stuck in an ice storm running the heater, I don't know how long these batteries will go until, like, if you let's say you're stuck in a bed where you're stuck for like eight hours, if they're gonna, the battery's gonna keep. It seemed like in my test, when I run that heat, it, it, it sucks that battery, and I, I get concerned if I'm stuck in an eight hour trip. Yeah. Well, you see, my thing is, again, it's like, but you charge at home, right? I charge at home, but yeah. you come out, yeah, you come out full when you go to go. But you know, God forbid, you get into an eight-hour. You know, again, when you're not running the heater, it's fine. You, the car can run for days. But when you're running that heater, how long can that heater go? That, that's a real, I, or, and that rear defroster. See, my only thing is, as far as road trips go, as far as I'm concerned, the best possible 
vehicle that I could use for a road trip is a Chrysler Pacifica minivan. You know what? I was thinking about, again, just for, for, for a second back apart by one of those cars with the plug. So you go to work the on the plug in Chrysler. It gets like 80 miles per gallon. Yeah. The plug in minivan yeah. and you got the backup engine. Back yeah, I think that is the greatest minivan. I, I just question how long it's gonna last because I don't know if price there. As long as you keep it on that max care warranty, you can you can go up to like a hundred and ten thousand miles before they won't warranty it anymore. Okay. But with and the max care, you can do a so lot of miles. Called max care. And where do you buy it from the dealer? Or you you, you get it from Mopar. Mopar. So I, I had to extend the warranties on my cars because I, I liked them so much. I just kept them because right now, especially you can't, if you trade in a car right now, there's almost nothing else you can buy because everybody's sold out. So, you know, that was my other part. Yeah. So I don't even know if they're even available to even buy if you want to plug in. But that looked like a great minivan just to have. As, uh, it's good. It, it's a great mini. It's, it's spacious. It's comfortable. It, I mean, you couldn't hope for another vehicle to put that much stuff in or that many people. Right. Especially when you're talking about like some astronomical price. You don't have to spend $70,000 on it. like 45, 40, yeah. 45, bucks, yeah. you know? No, check it out. It, the Chrysler minivan is easily the best. And then you got the two auto slide doors. It's got the key. You could open the doors for like your older mother. So or, basically you buy it and when you keep it for eight years, 110,000 miles, then you basically you have to trade it for something else because you don't want to be. Most of the people I know keep those minivans for like 10 years or better. Most of the people. Like okay, so uh, I, I, I took my uh, ex-girlfriend, I took her mom and she got one. Does that and have a still has, monitor also? They have all, they have everything. In fact, they have all wheel drive now with the, with the new one. They have, you can get red seats. You, they have yeah. every feature you yeah, could they imagine. Didn't, they didn't have all wheel drive on the sluggers. That I'd have to check again. I, I was staring at that. That, but the new ones have all wheel drive. The old one didn't have all wheel drive. Yeah. So therefore, if they added the plug, cause you know what they call it? They call it four by E. Uh -huh. So the new Jeep Grand Cherokee has 4xE, the new Wrangler has 4xE. Yeah, there's e. a Wrangler plug-in also. Yeah. So, but that car is too bad. No, yeah, I don't, yeah, Wranglers, is, that, that's something, if you live in like extreme off-road. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so I look at that thing as a, uh, just like a family car. I, 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 I just don't think the Tesla, like I think I have a kid coming, so like, I just don't think the test is big enough. I think it is part of the Grand Cherokee, so that's why it's Yeah, it's just not. So it's I think just maybe not. that price is going to be high with See, realistically, the Teslas are appliances. It's like it's ba back and forth to work. Right. I'm not paying for gas. That's the bottom line. That's what it does. Yeah. Like yeah. I said, I drove 25,000 miles. Mm -hmm. They have they have chargers at work. You know, the Tesla destination chargers. And it's free for us. And then they set it up. And then uh, I have a, my apartment. They, I got free charging there. Not free. I think I pay 30 bucks a month for the electricity or whatever. Basically, it's free, you know. Mm. It's just that it doesn't have the road presence of the S Class. That's what it is. The interior is great. But, yeah, yeah. The interior is nice. That's what I'm here for. It's probably part of the uh, air drag. Uh, yeah. The regenerative braking. Yeah. I, actually, I think it's for the drag coefficient, so the air, when it gets in there, it doesn't cause drag. Tesla's new wheel on the plate is nice. Oh yeah, the rack is? Yeah. Yeah, I'm probably gonna end up driving along with the, the older guy. The older gentleman with the cane. Yeah, the, unless, unless this one's available, because I, I can dump? Okay. Thank you. Oh yeah, we're gonna have to go way back in there. Way back machine. But carjacking's like way up. Okay. So you gotta be so careful. Okay. That's why I don't go out at night. Okay. I park and I'm in. Mm -hmm. Are you checking me out? Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Stop.
But that's the whole thing. These things are like limos. Right, they're made to be chauffeured. You can get the executive rear seat package turned into a Maybach. So. Yeah, I would like to see the Maybach version of this, but I know that's going to be so expensive. Oh, yeah. oh you mean the Saudi Arabia? Well, the Maybach versions are the uh, the ultra high, high trim, end. like when they got hummingbird feather pillows and this, that, and all that. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yes. Okay. All, all right. right. Yeah. Duck down. All right. Well, that's it. That's what it is. That's the Mercedes EQS. I'm I'm impressed. I'm impressed. Very impressed. Thank you. Oh no, thank you.